Across the road from the forestry block that borders my eastern boundary, my neighbours have just finished building a house for themselves. While they were building the house, they stayed on the property in a converted garage. Very kindly, they have allowed me to stay in the garage. So, a few days ago, I moved from my Airbnb in Dunedin to, well, across the road from work. It's got solar power for the lighting and gas for the cooking. Let's have a look inside. There's an entrance area for cooking. It's fully insulated and inside, uh, sleeping, a wood fire, a work area, which I'm utilizing already, and hmm, what would we say, utility room. Closed storage area is here, and this ladder actually leads to additional sleeping accommodation for two in the loft area. So we have sleeping for four people. Here's the battery, one kilowatt of uh, storage, which is certainly enough for the lights and my computer. And here, all the bits and pieces for cooking. Overall, I think this is going to be very pleasant. Shower and toilet facilities are down the hill. There's a sink outside for whatever. Inside, there's a gas-fired water heater and the shower. The water flows down into a tray. The toilet block is a little more agricultural. There it is, quite basic. No door or flusher, but a great view. It's marvellous to have neighbours like Dave and Elaine who have generously offered me their converted garage to stay in when I'm in Tyree Beach to do the planting of the trees and especially the construction of the house, which is going to be a long-term project. The convenience of not having to drive out from Dunedin every morning is fabulous. The inconvenience of being a little bit away from the shops is uh, going to be easy to solve. If you enjoy the content and want to follow this unique project, please like and subscribe. I'll be making more videos over the coming months and years to record the progress of this unique project. Thanks for watching.